we are already off it is the saturday wrap the saturday wrap for saturday the 16th of september 2023 i've got the curtains closed because the sun's going lower in the sky and it completely washed it well, it was one of them i can't remember but it was completely washed out anyway got the lightro glow on i uh, hope this looks okay if you haven't seen this before that's probably enough to put you off. This is me looking back on the past week and thinking about things that happened, like buses and tech and um, Christmas and video and such like. Anyway, um, so that's it, really. Um, you can comment. It'll be up practically everywhere. And although it's the Saturday wrap, is done on the Friday before, you know, things. Anyway, um, let's look back on the week. Uh, a week of remembrance. Today, the 15th, is Battle of Britain Day for those who protected this country. And um, Monday, 9-11, uh, 2001. Yeah, that wasn't a good day for anyone, to be perfectly honest. Yeah. So, anyway, let's start with the word or phrase of the week. And um, jumping forward on Wednesday, um, I was in Newport and I was in Tiny Rebel in the afternoon and I was watching a YouTube video about the air traffic controllers on 9 11. And there was quite a big seg segment on United 93. Um, it was the only hijacked aircraft out of the four that didn't reach its target. And uh, one of the pilots um, left the mic keyed open. And the phrase from that, as the people fought back, was, let's roll. <sighs> it was a very sad day. And I can remember where I was at the time yeah people did the right thing uh, anyway um up of the week and well, there's quite a few repeats here but windows update tuesday tuesday was a big day um it was the apple announcements and starting at the same time the september patch tuesday for windows and various versions and dot net and such like yeah, just remember it's there. Um, you don't have to wait for it. Hit the Windows key, type in, update, and it's there, and it's off. And I haven't gone into silent mode, but I don't really care, to be honest. Um, the thing of the week, as I have already mentioned, was the IT theatre, the distortion reality field of the Apple announcements iphone 15 four of uh, the uh, iphone uh, sorry the watch 10 the ultra watch 2 and um, coming up very soon uh, various bits of software including on monday ipad os 17 and ios 17. big thing about where our equipment stay alive and uh, look at all the trees we've planted and here's mother nature and i felt it was a little bit disjointed could have done with some more hardcore tech but that's just me etc it was good and i had the next day off as i think you've already discovered to just digest it anyway um so that was the thing of the week the song of the week again jumping forward to wednesday in newport in tiny rebel it was brett fan and it was first of all by budgie in the studio and then it was metallica live both excellent versions and the original stands up very well but then again it is classic rock and budgie local band well fairly local anyway so let me jump back to saturday and go through the week so saturday yeah uh, looking forward to a day out uh, in newport the weather was hot and the weather was sunny and the 25 to 8 bus just didn't show uh, despite the fact that the stagecoach app of course says it was going to be on time and it just didn't show however got to ruderin p super completely pea super most of newport was fairly pea super as well 
it's autumn and that was the end of the hot spell although in the afternoon when the pea soup had disappeared it was warm it was definitely warm um sunday planted the last of my spring onions of the year into um chocolate tubs which are just about starting to come through it's still nice and warm this week despite the fact we've had rain and grayness and hot weather i think it's about 21 at the moment which will help them germinate and grow and i hope they do to be perfectly honest because spring onions through winter works for me also did some washing duvet covers and such like oh, that is remarkably dull and boring and especially when it rains a bit and they're out on the line but what can you do a monday oh sorry sunday also um on saturday a dt Br dt brown seed catalog arrived definitely a sign of autumn start to get planning now what potatoes i'll get what other seeds i'll get uh, actually might actually write them down this time as opposed to where did i see that lots of other seed catalogs are arriving and to be honest it's really a, just a case of who oh, you can get the best discount with etc so sunday wandering around in bdu shorts okay uh, ready for monday take all your stuff out of my pockets put them into your jeans ready for monday monday put my jeans on can't find my car keys should be in my right hand pocket no problem this has happened before i have an air tag on there i'll use my iphone to detect it it was about 20 to 25 minutes and i couldn't find it i was close i was in two to three feet of it because uh, americans feet that sort of thing <sighs> still couldn't find it it was making lots of noise because you can get it to bleep in the end it wasn't in my side pocket it was in my back pocket so of course i couldn't get closer to it because every time i got fairly close with the iphone yeah i turned around and it, mm. so model of story check all your pockets first i wish i did and i feel a little bit silly <laughs> but what can you do um uh, monday um monday was a Tuesday I can't honestly remember to be perfectly honest I think it was Monday because I was looking at Instagram on Sunday and the Gloucester Brewery announced Oktoberfest so I'm booked in for and here's my trick the Friday and the Sunday I'm ignoring the Saturday because last time it was completely packed out and there was no space and I didn't enjoy it as much Friday Nice and gentle Sunday, nice and gentle. Although they did run out to some beers on Sunday, so I hope they get more in. But they are talking about more craft beers this year as well, so that could be good. Um, I've got two sessions 12 till 5 Friday, 12 till 5 Sunday. Coming back on the Monday, got a couple of other days off as well. Looking forward to it while we're there. I remember seeing um, a 24 four pound 99 pack of lots of original german oktoberfest beers in little decided i need to get them Disco discovered there that the leaflet was a week old and it was uh, when it's gone it's gone and when i went to um a little on tuesday i can't remember which day of the week it was i think it was tuesday they had all gone however all the are now doing Oktoberfest beers. Only three. The fourth one was um, Bex, and that's brewed in Bremen, and that's uh, Pilsner. So, um, yeah, I got those instead. A little bit cheaper, they're only one ninety nine a bottle. But, you know, life is like that. Um, also, Tuesday. Been having some issues with my uh, Google Home display, like not finding the Wi Fi. And then it would, and then it wouldn't, and whatever. And it did it again. And I thought, I only use it as a clock. And it's just sucking electricity. So I've had it for four years. I end of life it. Bye-bye. And it went. Um, so I'm saving a little bit of energy. 
I don't think it's a great deal at all, to be perfectly honest. Um, yeah, oh, it was Tuesday, Littles. Um, oh, Wednesday, after the Apple announcement, which I enjoyed. It's very sad, but I did enjoy it. Newport, um, which was really nice and gentle. I had a can of Beaver Town non-alcoholic beer. I think it was... They charged me the same as a pint, but I think it was about four quid fifty for a three thirty milliliter can. Uh, thank you to the guy behind the bar in uh, the pen and wig. Uh, but wow, <laughs> no alcohol tax on those. Uh, but there you go. And um, later on, after Harbour Fish Bar, large chips, well, actually small, but there was going to be a large portion, which I love them for. And thank you very much. Um, Tiny Rebel. They were filming a Christmas lunch. I mean, you know, lights, uh, stills, videos, whatever. No sign of Santa, though. That was the only issue. Sat in the corner, watched the videos, as I said, listened to podcasts, sucked off their very fast symmetrical Wi-Fi. And uh, £3 a pint, um, Monday, Tuesdays and Wednesdays, and now cask beer in the bar. And actually, they're doing Oktoberfest as from, I think it's tomorrow. They're doing it in all three bars, although did read in the article, not all the beers are available in Tiny Rebel Newport. Why? I have no idea. No idea at all. But I have a feeling next Saturday I will be there. I've got something different planned for tomorrow, and it involves little ales. Well, there you go. Okay, um, yesterday, um, Aldi, no, let's go back, it involves Aldi Ales, and I got them yesterday. Today, another person in the office, who wasn't there at the time, tested positive for COVID. COVID is all around, need to be careful about that. And, uh, of course, it is a Battle of Britain Day, a day. We should think about the people who have actually fought fascists. It's easy to say, but they actually did it. Right. Um. Yeah. I could put some jeans out on the line. How are we doing? Oh, we've done tons. Um. Bye bye. Uh, Mastodon X uh, threads. Uh, WordPress. You know the things. All right.